The Gold Coast father and his two young daughters have been left shaken after they copped an abusive tirade while out shopping. The Muslim girls wanted to keep their headscarves on to protect themselves from the cold when they came under attack. It's heartbreaking to think a Queensland child could be subjected to this. He said the bad words and he said the very bad words to us and he said to us the bad F word. Every morning, seven-year-old Medina and her five-year-old sister don these headscarves as part of their uniform at the Australian International Islamic College on the Gold Coast. Outside of school hours, it's all pink and ponytails. So... Normally when they get into the car, they take off the veil off. But when Ahmad picked his daughters up from school and went grocery shopping at Southport, the girls asked to keep their veils on as it was cold and raining. So when we come outside, this old, older gentleman, probably 60s or something, he looked at me and goes, you animal, look what you're doing to these kids. Shaking, Ahmad took his daughters to his wife in the car park and returned to speak with their abuser only to be confronted by a second man. Oh, he's like, F off you Muslim, nobody likes you. I'm like, excuse me, are you being racist? And he's like, no nah, mate, I just hate Muslims. Ahmad has lived in Australia for the past 22 years. That I am more Aussie than the person who abused us. And I was really hurt, really hurt. What's more, Nine News has learned children are copying abuse at school too. Uh, sometimes we do have um, bikes driving across the road and during class time they're revving um, their bikes and certain things, yelling. Haley, are police looking into these attacks? Well, yes, they are, Andrew. The school has been reporting these attacks to police as they happen. And anyone caught partaking in this kind of racial abuse can, in the least, be charged with public nuisance. And in extreme cases, they face up to six months behind bars. Thanks, Hayley.